Are these even Christmas trees? Aw, they're all so skinny and sick looking. Can you turn that one around, please? Mom wants to see his tree bud. Everybody's got their thing. I'm more of a branch man. Mm. Okay, well, you guys decide on which scrawny tree to buy. We're gonna go over there and practice our Santa containment strategies. I assume he knows jujitsu. Uh, can I come? Your mom's gonna be at least another half hour here. Uh, you're not part of the plan, Dad. Well, I could help. I'm bigger than you. Yeah, but you're weak. Santa would drop you, and that would kill me. I could take Santa. Okay, Dad. Hey, Tina, thanks for helping Louise beat up Santa. She really believes she can catch him. Yeah, it's so nice that she still believes in this mission. <laughs> it's weird, right? Isn't Nine a little old to, uh, believe that? To w believe what? The, what, um... In the mission? Uh, okay, forget it. Never mind. Good talking to you. Good talking to you, Dad. Finally! A truck you're allowed to lick! Ah, ah. Gene, focus! Okay, let's go through this again. We'll pretend the porta potty is a tree and Santa's on his way to deliver presents. Gene, you be Santa. Phase one, Santa passes right by the kitchen where he sees cookies. These rocks are the cookies. <laughs> Phase two, Santa finds a note that says milk in the fridge. I'm thirsty. Phase three, when he opens the fridge and grabs the glass of milk, bam, his wrist is stuck in a zip tie. Ah! That's when I jump out and wrap myself around his ankle. Ooh. Yeah, then Tina jumps on his back and makes Kringle crumble. Ah, I'll gouge out his eyes and pull in his beard. Ah! Whoa, 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 we want him alive. Sorry, I got carried away. 